What up party people, we are officially back with the sorcery only, magic only run of demon souls. Yeah, I took a bit of a, well, not even a break, I was knocking out some Sekiro uh, in the meantime. Uh, a very difficult part of Sekiro, so that's why, it's something that took me quite a while. Are these things... Oh, they're not dead. Fuck. As I've said... Well, first of all, we don't even need to come into this little corner here. But as I've said, one of the most frustrating things is like when you're right on the edge of being able to one-shot something. Oh, shit. Oh, because that was a soul ray, wasn't it? Oh, no, it wasn't. We've done the calculation on this, I remember now. Okay, never mind. We are near the shortcut anyways, which will allow us to go back to the Nexus and replenish MP for free. If the game is kind enough, it'll also allow me to level up. <clears throat> because I feel like one more point in the intelligence would... I see, that one was one shot. Because of the clever rat ring. Shit. Does the clever rat ring actually... I just used two. That was stupid. Uh, does it actually work on magic? I'm guessing it does. Man, this is so good. This looks so good. Cool. I think we're just gonna take the... Hold on a second. I'm stupid. Yeah, the elevator is not running yet. Never mind. I completely forgot about this point, but one thing I'm gonna do, well, first of all, get rid of all this shit. The clever rat ring does work. Is it called clever rat ring? Just making sure I'm using the right terminology. Yeah, it does. Well, okay. So I was talking some bullshit. Uh, like two episodes ago, because I specifically said this doesn't work with magic in this game, but I am wrong. And if there is one situation where I'm happy to be wrong, it's this one. See, this does in present some interesting tactical like decisions, you know. Because of the implication, you know. I mean, I still have a feeling that later down the line this is going to be pretty much a non-issue, but you know, it's a good it's a good thing to keep in mind. Getting to the clever rat state is not that difficult in this game. There are a bunch of ways to uh, damage yourself. So why am I even picking any of this shit up? Mm. So you know, it's it's. A possibility. I am a hundred percent gonna heal here though because we have dogs coming up and you know how it is with dogs in this game they can like really wonderful shot they can really wipe the floor with you and this is sort of a little bit far from any checkpoints and I'd rather not risk anything here This is taking a lot of MP though. So we're gonna be needing to buy some spice on the next Nexus sort of visit. This is what I'm talking about. Like it's better to be safe with these enemies. There's no Oh yes I can. Okay, I can shoot over the wall. Cool. And I'm yeah, there should be one more dog, right? If there isn't, I'm gonna be happy. Like, I'll, I'll take that. No complaining, it's just... You know. Okay, we just gotta clear these guys out, which should be fairly easy. Yeah. 
And I think we are perfect on the MP, right on the money. Because this is where, yeah, hell yeah. And now I can make it back. Cool. So as you know, this activates the, the water, which activates the platforms. Oh no, it deactivates it. Never mind. Apparently I'm mistaken. It redirects, maybe. That's a better way. Yeah, it does. It's a better way of putting it. Haptic feedback on the controller. Anyways, I'm gonna go and make it back to the Nexus. I'm so stupid. This elevator and that thing are two separate things. Fuck. Okay, well, I'm a dumbass. Uh, I just realized. I think I'm getting get this. Conf I got this confused with the other because there is some other elevator which is activated by the shit. Well, people were probably screaming at their monitors, but whatever. I'm an idiot. Like I can't help it. Uh, I don't have every single thing in this game memorized, even though I should. Okay, so here in the Nexus, I think what I'm going to do is we're going to use a couple of souls here. Um, that gives us a thousand, putting us right on the edge of being able to level up our magic one more. This should just put me over the edge of being able to deal one shot damage. And I think the other thing we're going to do is we're going to pop some of the larger souls. And we're going to buy some spice. Seven. I think that's enough for now. Twelve. Yeah, we have twelve. That should hold us over to till the rest of the level, till the end of the level, I should say. All right, let's get back to where we were. All right, moment of truth. God damn it! What? What? It does zero damage. Unbelievable. Yeah, I'm, I'm. I'm missing one. I know I technically broke the rules there, but. Oh shit, a Murden Hammer? Interesting. I know I technically, if you really want to be stringent about it, broke the rules there, but I think for that experiment we are going to allow it. I cannot believe it that I'm <laughs> I'm a single point of damage away from... It just makes it extra frustrating. Now I'm even more annoyed about this than I was before. Unbelievable. Well, what can you do? Anyways, more upgrade stones. And this pretty much leads to the end of the level. The armored spider is going to be interesting, I think. With some of these bosses, I have no earthly idea how they're going to go. It's really like a crapshoot. Hey, can't I? Can I like reverse trick this guy? No, I cannot. He, he's supposed to blow up the room. Or those barrels. And be an asshole about it. Okay, I think I won that encounter. Haha! <laughs> nice. Alright, Fatso. The fog gate held you up. I still don't like their redesign. Oh, hey, MC Hammer Pants. That does look pretty wizard-y. You know, or something. Them MC Hammer Pants. Yeah, I still don't like the fat official redesign. I like almost all the aspects of the redesign, except how the fat officials look. I feel like... They, as I've said this before in the other playthrough, like, I really felt like they looked sort of unsettling before. Not, you know, this isn't Silent Hill, but, you know, they kind of looked like something not human trying to appear human. And it's just kind of like badly mimicking what we look like. And now they just kind of look gross and... I don't know. I feel like that's not the point. Now this this is the item, right? Yeah, the Chris blade. 
And if I if I remember correctly, this is the one, right? Ampli yes. The interesting thing is it amplifies dealt and received magic damage. Now the question of course is how much and you do yeah you do need to have it equipped. I think the shield is not going to do much good for us here. I think I am going to rock the crisp blade because it, it would be stupid not to. I can't think of too many. Well, it depends on what the game counts as magic damage. Whether, for example, it would count the armored spider's fire shots as magic damage. I don't think it would. So, yeah, that's just... We'll just have to wait and see on that. Again, I have a feeling this is not going to be a topic of conversation later down the line. Oh shit, okay, I got hit by that. I think I still need to... pay the attack. If I could. God, that has quite a hitbox on it. Yes, do that, please. I think I need to like find the sweet spot. Oh fuck! Yeah, yeah, yeah. As I've said, I do like that this actually has like a visual tell to it now. Uh, that he he actually does something. Yeah, so you gotta. Sp find a sweet spot of like is the wrong thing I was gonna heal I think I can just brute force this honestly yeah fairly easy who am I kidding insanely easy just pew 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 and you know there's gonna be a time where we have enough MP that really soul ray is going to be our main damage source. And it's such a shame that you cannot sell shit in this game. It would be so dope to be able to sell all these like useless ass upgrade materials for oh yeah you get the pure one. That that can only be used if you if you're wondering spider stone can only be used to upgrade bows. Uh, it makes the sticky bow which might might have been renamed uh, that's not a not exactly the most fortunate. Did I not have the Chris Blade equipped? Was I an idiot? Whatever. As you saw, it didn't really fucking matter, did it? Shit, a single level. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get up to 25. And what we also need to do is see if we can construct anything from the Demon Soul. Always gotta check. Cool. Oh shit. Oh, it's this. This is a pretty cool spell. Uh it's it's not exactly useful, but this is a this is a dope spell. I'm going to get it just because. Let's see. So, as it says on the books or in the description, Oh, that is very cool. <laughs> that is very cool. Fucking drive by on this shit. Man, that that looks so dope. I'm in love with this spell. You can fucking drive by with it. Oh, and it has like an arc to it. That is the dopest shit ever. I love this thing. It's probably absolutely useless if I remember correctly this spell is pretty shit because it de deals like no damage but man is that sick or what 
All right, I'm just gonna deposit my stuff and also get more fresh spice. I should really go farm for some, but yeah, whatever. I need to farm for healing items too. Okay, I think the probably the best place to go would be here. Uh, Shrine of Storms, mainly to unlock patches and also the other merchant as well. Uh, we really gotta get on that because you know they have the good the good healing items. We gotta get on that shit. That is so dope. <laughs> that is so dope. I, I'm 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 gonna be like all over this spell. Holy shit. Nice. He didn't do bad damage either. Well, mm, you know, compared to. And I'm assuming Soul Ray is a one shot. No, it's not. If it's not a one shot, it's not worth it for the MP cost. As we've determined. Now, this area. I don't expect too many problems. Even the manta rays. You can shoot them out of the sky with your magic. So that like removes another problem. Plus this area ain't exactly difficult to begin with. Talisman of God. This isn't the one that... No, no, no. There's another one that can cast both miracles and sorceries. But this isn't the one. I miscalculated. Whoops. Well, that that's actually the first death in a while. Fuck. Annoying that it happened on this place too. Cool. Made it. That was much easier. I mean, this isn't difficult, I just screwed up. Which happens. Nobody's perfect. <laughs> this spell, man. This spell. It's too good. Not sure if killing these guys with that is, like, really efficient. But, man, does it feel good. What a bitch. <sighs> Fuck, it missed. So, you know, I was talking about how we'll be able to shoot them out of the sky. Well, maybe. We'll see about that. Copper key. Nice. Let's visit the other side as well, because I didn't fully explore there. I, I really made a mess of this place on my first playthrough. I was running all over the place like an idiot, like a fart in a fan factory, which is one of my personal favorite sayings. Uh, I feel like I have a better grip of where everything is now. Of course, you know when the boy says shit like that is when he's gonna get the most lost. But I, I have high hopes for myself. Oh, come on! What was that dodge? Unbelievable. This thing should be like a rocket. Crescent, falchion, broken weapon. As everybody knows. I think this is it. Talk about revenge. Plus you have more space here. <laughs> that is so dope. Fuck. Ah. Oh. Just on the edge. Has a lot of HP. Oh come on, seriously, is that stupid? Okay, maybe he's not that stupid. What a manta ray, you shit bitch. They dropped some dope like upgrade materials. Fuck this guy has a lot of HP. But man is he stupid. I mean this is this is going to be the fight of the century. Um, he's serious. He's seriously not gonna react. Cool. Well, I'm just gonna sit here and kill him then. So I'll see you guys in just a second.
and the dumbest fight in the history of Demon Souls goes to this encounter. Uh, that was that was quite something. Yeah, they drop Cloudstone, and if I remember correctly, this is the weapon that, like, this upgrade path is the one that slowly restores your MP. Which I might be thinking about. Uh, unfortunately, you cannot infuse your catalyst with that. But if I can get, like, a dagger or something infused with Cloudstone, I mean, listen, it could help. It could be that dope shit we need. Mm, I'm gonna go into the tunnels here a little bit first. Because this is where that boy is. Oh, Soul Ray. I should have used a Soul Ray. There was ever a situation that called for it. It was this. I missed my chance. Man, I love them particle effects. The spells look really cool in this game. They look really awesome. Again, I know I'm sucking the dick of this game's graphics, but they're impressive, you know. Like My little heart thinks back to how Demon Souls used to look. <laughs> this guy, Wayne Rooney, I swear. Yeah, Blige, he's like the in-between patches. He sells healing items for a pretty good price. Not as good as patches, but... Still okay. Three hundred for fresh, fresh spice. Uh, I'm. Mm, let's get ten. Why? Not? I don't know why ten. Just felt like the right thing. But unfortunately, he pales in comparison to patches. It's really a shame that patches is the most useful merchant in this entire game. Because, man, would it be satisfying to kill his ass sometimes. On the spot, I mean. And I'm not talking about, like, killing him late game or something like that. Because you can, just like in any Souls game, kill everyone in the Nexus before the final boss if you want to. But that doesn't sort of have the same... Like, a fucking lock-on. Seriously. Lock on to this bitch. That doesn't have like the same level of satisfaction as killing him on the spot, you know. But unfortunately you're shooting yourself in the foot. This camera is unbelievable. Ho oh, ho! Damn. Cod sniper montage. Bob, 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 bob. Get the dubstep in here. That was one of the stupidest internet trends ever, the COD montages, which then became absolutely hilarious when people started to parody it. Then it became good. Fucking bro step, that's the official name. Oh no, man, I never like looked out here. I love the skybox here. Uh, so I could trade, probably not even worth it. I I'll, I'll have to check if you can trade something for spice. And maybe they give spice for something, that would be dope. Alright, let's get back to where we were. And this area, that's where we need to go next. I was just about to say we can actually skip this area, but I realized this is the way forward, so... Can't exactly do it. Well, I can always quit out of this level, but it ain't gonna help. I'm not sure I'll get the adjudicators. It's cool and everything, but I don't know, man. Come on. Come on. You just gotta be at the right distance to kill these things. And 
Of course, there is a dude right there. Yeah, yeah, you just have to drop down. How do I always get lost here? God, this thing is awesome. See, there is still a little part of me that sort of wants to kill this guy. So I'm gonna. Stocked up on soul rays, why not? I got the bloodlust, you know. Unless they're dropping bladestone at an alarming rate, so either I'm getting insanely lucky or they fucked around with the drop rate. A little bit. Because this thing, I always remember people bitching about bladestone, how hard it was to get. And people said that it was possibly the most difficult upgrade path to go for. Because you just know nothing dropped it consistently. You'd have to farm these guys for hours. Which is never fun. And that's why you should be careful. Where is that motherfucker? He's gonna get fire sprayed the hell out of here. Yeah. Start your attack run. Y-wing. You don't like fire, do you? I need to go back and finish. Not on the, the channel, but I need to go finish Star Wars Squadrons, I swear. <gasps> oh, uh oh. That was a panic noise. I thought I was screwed because he was gonna push me off. Still? Still messing with this shit? Get out of here. Thank fuck these guys are this stupid. I mean... Interestingly, that they can guard against melee, but not magic, for some reason. Hey, I'll take it. You don't see me complaining. Hell no. Late Moon, that's another Thieves Ring. Oh no, it's not. This is that other thing. Grave Robbers, yeah. Just in case. Mr. Anime. God, that's so dope. That's less dope. Come on. See, that does... Like I said, that does have a ring of satisfaction to it. Being in clever rat state, but... It's dangerous, man. It's it's too dangerous. Too dangerous, as they say in France. Let's de-equip this shit and let's fight the adjudicator, who I think you can fight from up here. Yeah, you can. But the only annoying thing is he's actually more dangerous like this. Because he does this with his stupid tongue. And that has a messed up hitbox to it. See? A super messed up hitbox. Holy shit. Damn. Okay, so I'm staying in uh, phantom form here. Let's see if it's possible to make it past this guy. Yes, it is. Cool. I've done this run back, believe me. It's just annoying that I lost my souls, unfortunately. And let's just see what happens if I go down to his level. Whether it's still possible to hit the bird from there. Yes, it is. Okay, that's going to be the solution to this problem. Fuck that tongue. 
I know that's not a phrase you hear often, but seriously. This is playing a dangerous game, honestly. Because as you can imagine, this guy doesn't hit lightly. I'm just hoping I can do this in one rep. One rap of magic. And I cannot, I, I'm not far. Kill it. Kill it. Well. It's not exactly the proudest moment of my life that I died to the adjudicator, but it's just a tongue man, like like this boss specifically staying anywhere up there is asking for trouble. Uh basically. It was my really my fault. Still, that was okay. That was okay two areas down basically and we have a bunch of souls i'm not sure anything can be made from adjudicators uh maybe with yuria i really need to check that shit but the important thing is for now i'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode of demon souls spells only i think this playthrough is mostly going smoothly can't really complain can i uh we're getting more powerful we're just gonna continue getting more powerful and we have some dope spells now it's just getting more mp and more magic damage it's the name of the game next time we're going to tackle we might as well just sort of go in order uh i don't need more healing items for sure though anyways i'll end it here thank you guys very much for watching as always if you did enjoy this episode make sure to give it a like comment subscribe turn on post notifications as always if you don't have them turned on already take care and peace out.